Hello, my fellow gamers. Welcome, welcome back to the game here. Welcome back to Back to the Game. It's been a couple months. You know, stuff and things. Anyway, we're going to tackle a game that I've actually wanted to play for a long time, which is called Metal Wolf Chaos. I freaking love this game. I've played a little bit of it, but I'm going to let our president take over. A glorious leader. By the end of the first quarter of the 21st century, freedom was dead in America. Beginning with a large-scale military coup d'etat that erupted in various cities throughout the nation, the rebels seized power in all the central institutions of government. The entire nation appeared to have fallen completely into the hands of the coup d'etat forces. However, one final hope in opposing the coup d'etat forces remained. This final hope being the U.S. president himself. Michael Wilson, the 47th president of the United States, equipped with a special mobile armored ops suit developed in secret by the military, boldly waged his own... to take back America's freedom. 47th? So technically potentially the next president of our timeline. Get so out my special op suit, Jody. Get my... Oh, what like is it? Um, where's my special su super this suit? Yeah. Holy freak. How many guns do I need? A lot. So... This game is literally the most American game I've ever seen from Japan. Let's party! Welcome to the White House. You have two guns at all time. Bunch of people. And... The first level you can actually beat really quickly. More of a tutorial to get your grips on the game. And you gotta kind of wait a little bit. Oh, uh, wait. Uh, rocket! Apparently I'm not good at shooting rockets. Alright, I'm ready to move on, game. There it is. Is that it? Shield here. There we go. The enemy are just slowly foot soldiers. Even if they aim at you and fire, they're no match for your special Thank you. I appreciate you telling me. But who doesn't like giant Gundams destroying stuff? I mean, I'm not really a Gundam. The Eagle Star is beyond here. Get going before the enemy chases after you. I do what I want. Proceed ahead while destroying anything that stands in your way. Ah! Oh, yes, you can just sprint. What is this? Nope. Okay. Let me go the other way. It's really fun just to dash through all these things. I figured this out a couple days ago. I'm like, okay, we're going to do this correctly. Mr. President, there's an aircraft hangar beyond this passageway. Now let's hurry. Okay. The is the Open the door then. Open the now. Thank you. Please wait a moment. Okay. We have a little map that shows up where everything is. Oh, I waited long enough. Whoa, something quite dangerous awaits. What? Missiles of that caliber. Yeah, that hurt. Aim and fire. You should be able to easily shoot them down. But I don't want to aim. I just want to spray and pray. It is cool. You can actually shoot the missiles down too. And there's actually more on this side. Though you'd think one bolt from an M4 would not insta kill somebody. 
Luckily, ammo is... I went the wrong way. Is very... Uh, plentiful. Preparations will be complete soon. All right. Well, looky here. More guests. Well, I guess they won't be voting for you next term. Mr. President, the enemy is taking aim at Air Force One. Please be careful. Well, it's a shame that they're going to die. I mean, if you're a soldier, okay, and you have this giant mech thing fighting you, what would you do? Not fight it? Because that's the correct answer. Did I already kill them all? And then you all don't hurt me. Sorry to keep you waiting, Mr. President. Yeah, how dare you? That for a ticketless ticket. Ah. Thank you, I appreciate it. I've probably been on here a couple times. Game really has not aged well. Like they were ever invited, they're definitely Michael. Michael. <laughs> uh, what's Michael doing in my White House, Mr. President? It looks like this party is just getting started. Well, I didn't do anything right as usual. I had an S damage points? I feel like I did nothing right there. Just speed run it. You're not gonna talk? Alright, so basically in short, the vice president's calling a coup. And everybody hates us. But we're gonna take care of it. Jody, update me as to the status of the nation. The Pentagon, the United Nations, and all central government institutions have fallen into the hands of the Vice President. Have they? Mr. President, believe in your own justice. I'm sure your father would have told you the same. Probably not. Jody. How's my schedule? You've got a conference and dinner party at the Japanese Embassy regarding wildlife protection. Oh yeah. Sorry, but I'll have to cancel that. I'm heading out to save America. Can you let them know I won't be able to make it? <laughs> yes, Mr. President. America! To my beloved fellow Americans, good evening. This is an announcement from the Government Policy Promotion Department, your American justice and freedom supporter. First of all, what I would like to tell each and every one of you is this. Recent events were not a mere coup d'etat, but rather a revolution to correct the wrongs in the United States of America. To our regret, our nation is in a crisis situation. Since 2010, domestic terrorism problems have increased rapidly. Economic disputes originating from the exhaustion of fossil fuels and the sudden rise in unemployment due to the influx of large-scale immigration. Neither the current president nor the American government took actions to address these various problems. On the contrary, they have filled their own pockets adhering to terrorist cells. To correct this situation, Richard Hawk, Arizona insurrection hero and vice president of the old government, 
and the U.S. military rose to the task at hand. Much like our ancestors did, based in a belief of winning freedom, and based in the belief of an independent war, and based in the belief in this great nation. However, to our regret, an evil to disobey this belief exists in the United States of America, too. And here is that evil. This villainous terrorist who first appeared in Washington and began his unjust rampage goes by the alias Metal Wolf. His current whereabouts are unknown. While all of America will be under martial law until Metal Wolf is caught, please do not confuse the issues at hand. Without fail, the U.S. military elite forces with a combined strength of 1.5 million promise to smash this unforgivable evil to pieces. This has been an announcement from the Government Policy Promotion Department, your special remedy for all kinds of evil. Alright, hold on, hold on, hold on. We have a government that is mad at oil, unemployment, and large-scale immigration. For a coup. This game takes place roughly in the 2020s. I, I, I feel like it's pretty accurate to something, and I can't figure it out. That was the worst call in in my life. It does. Target areas that the enemy force uses as the base of their military activities are built around the town. Uh huh. Target areas where enemy forces are constantly. I need to hit that again. Target areas. Annihilate the enemy force and make the liberation of San Francisco shine as a beacon of hope in your counter offensive. This mission goes by the call name Metropolitan Recapture Operation from Cisco's <laughs> side and throat. You are not allowed to make names up. Good luck and Godspeed, Mr. President. So. <sighs> Hold up. There's a lot of dumb stuff, and I'm loving this so far. But next time on Metal Wolf Chaos XD HD MNLP, we're going to tackle San Francisco. I'll see you then.